show Kevin, who is holding the camera, how to check and fix timing. He just put a brand new string set on this bow, and it's been kind of sitting there with the strings on it. So we're just going to check it, and uh, if it needs to be fixed, we'll adjust it. So the first thing is I'm going to draw the bow back in my little deal here, and I'm watching right here. That is the draw stop, and then over here is draw stop right there. And I'm watching to see if they both touch at the same time. And you see, this one is touching, but this one, there's still a gap right there. So what I'm going to do is I need to put a couple of twists in this string right here to, make the, to match this gap. So this, I just know from experience, is about two, maybe three twists. So I'm going to put three twists in it, and then we'll retest. So come over here to the bow press. Put the bow in it. So come over here, Kevin, so you can see this part right here. So I'm going to do this string. This is the control cable, so I'm just going to relax in the press until I can take that off of the anchor right there. And then I'm going to look right here at the string and this direction tightens the string right there. I can see that right there, okay? So I'm going to go one, two, three, like that. Then I'm going to put that back here, hook it on, make sure that it's on its track I'll pull up on the shooting string like that just to make sure that everything is in and didn't any strings fall off of their spots. And then I'll take it out of the press and then we'll pull it on the uh, pulley again. So here we are. You'll probably want to get outside over here on this side here. Here we are, pull down, pull it on the pulley get almost right there and I'm watching this come around and touch and then I look and it's just a tiny hair you see that little bit right there it's a tiny hair from being perfect I'm gonna put one more twist in it Put one more twist, take it off, make sure I'm going in the right direction, and one more, and I'll put it back on, pull up on it, we're good, take the pressure off, we're going to retest, okay, put that in, pull down, Watching that come around and touch. And that one is right there as well. Dead on, ready to go. Now, this is just the beginning. So both cams are touching the cable at the same time. You can also use the creep tune method so that you can make sure that the bow is in time as you shoot it. So this is the beginning. Then you can creep tune. For more on creep tuning, search GRIV, G-R-I-V, creep tune in Google, and there'll be a couple of uh, manuals for creep tuning that I've put out there on the web, and you can find that, maybe a video coming later. But right here, this is how you basic set the timing on a bow.